After The Sims 1, The Sims has been adding new life states to every game after. The Sims 2 adding toddler, teen, elder with an aging system. The Sims 3 adding young adults. Now I know what you guys are going to say, young adults were in The Sims 2, but they weren't introduced as a choosable life state until The Sims 3. And now officially in The Sims 4, we have infants. Babies will now be known as newborn babies and infants take the place between newborns and toddlers. I am really excited to play with this. The update just came out today a few hours ago. Well, not a few hours, a few minutes ago. But I'm really excited and I can't wait to play with this new update. <laughs> I'm so excited. So I got my sim here. You guys already know him. And we're just going to have a lot of fun. And we're just going to play with infants. So let's just get straight into it. The thing we're going to do is we're going to design a nursery. Because we need to be able to get ready for the infant. So I'm just going to take over this room. And we're going to turn it into a nursery. Be right back. So I quickly set to get this new nursery so we'd be ready for just the new infant and ready. So something also they added was if you go here under home, it now has the ability to make a science baby. Now they had science babies back in The Sims 3, uh, Into the Future, you could do this. So what you can do is you could do it as a single parent or you can have two Sims, do it together. You just have to be really good friends with them. And yeah, it's actually a really good detail to have in the game. So let's quickly go have a science baby, Garrett. Just one adult. That's it. Oh, it's a girl. Okay, I'm gonna think. I'm gonna just go with the f one of the names, Lauren. All right, let's do Lauren. Hey, I chose a fake last name. I'm smarter than that. So what now they have is now the babies are known as. Shut up, Papa Two. I don't want to do that right now. Ugh. What I was saying is that we have a new life state. Well, it's not really new, but babies are now known as newborns. As you can tell, they have they have added all skin tones. So babies no longer have only the three. They have all skin tones that are accessible in the game. Babies will also add the genetic eye color, which you can see it's brown. My Sims and my real life eyes are brown. And yeah, and as you can see, it looks a little more like a newborn rather than a regular baby. So now they made it so if I were to queue up a bunch of these, he won't keep putting the baby down. We can set what kind of feeding preference they want. Why can't I hitch up? Not available to age up. We'll find out about that in a sec. Let's first let's first get to know our new child. We and this another one skills now have a little icon above them so you can tell what skill you're building. It's a nice little thing, a little good quality item. Here we go. Now I can age her up. I was about to say him. Sorry, yeah. Throughout The Sims, I'm known for having boys for the first time. It's been a while since I've had a girl. What's it? Oh, I forgot. Now they place bottles and diapers as trash. They don't just, you don't just do it and they, that's all. You actually have to throw away the trash. So first we're going to age up our little baby here. Oh, yes. Aw, come on, clown. Okay, so they have a total of six traits. So we have sensitive. These sims are prone to diaper rash, are often picky with food, and can more easily become overstimulated by too much play and social interaction. However, they also rest more peacefully through the night when soothed. Then we got sunny. These sims are bursting with smiles and giggles and enjoy engaging with other sims, but they do not require more social attention. Wiggly, these sims all are always on the go and want to play and move about. However, they often struggle to fall asleep or pay attention for extended periods of time. Calm. These sims like to watch the world, are less likely to cry or become angry, and don't grow tired of activities as easily as other infants. However, they are less likely to explore the world on their own. Then there's cautious. These sims appreciate the familiar, but are slow to warm up to new experiences, locations, and sims. And lastly, intense. These sims have big emotions and are easily entertained, but they are also more difficult to calm when in a bad mood. So I'm just going to randomize it and we'll just see what I get. Three, two, one. Calm. Okay. We'll see what happens. Oh, look, she's flying out a little. Oh, that's adorable. Aww. Don't stare at your phone. Stop playing video games. She's so cute. I'm gonna delete the bass net. We don't, we don't, we, I don't need you anymore. It said we have some new toys for toddlers, like sensory stimuli toys. So we have this one, and they said they each have different noise cues. So we'll have to listen to that. They have this one, this one, 
and this one. So I'm just going to get all three of those. There are some more decorations, but I didn't get them as of right now. I'm just getting my sim to take care of everything. Okay, so we can control as her. Let's see her. So they have all the needs. So she's calm, all right? <laughs> she has an inventory, and she knows sims. Let's, oh, look how cute she is. Oh, that's so cute. I'm going to have her crawl here. And I could say get carried by. So we're just going to have to have some fun with the top. With, oh, I'm sorry. I am so used to saying toddler. Oh, <laughs> she's so cute. Talk to Lauren. Talk to your new dog. Cuddle. Let's bounce her. I want to see what some of these interactions look like. Play peekaboo. Aww. I, wa I want to see what these interactions are. Come on, let's see him. Aww, how cute she looks. This is an adorable update. I love this new life stage. Aww. So cute. I don't have time for the welcome wagon right now. I'm busy playing with my infant. So we can upgrade the bed. So, oh, baby mobiles are free. Like, you don't need any handiness skill, but to convert to a toddler bed, you need a handiness skill level 2 before you can do anything. Play peekaboo with Lauren. I want, I, I want to see a little interaction. Maybe we'll try some baby food in the chair. Oh, she's just trying to convert. Oh, oh. Ah, that's so cute! I love that! How long do babies stay babies? I have it on normal lifespan. Babies... <laughs> not 27, that's adults. Five days. So basically they remain an infant for five days. I keep calling them babies. I'm so sorry. It's just so cute and it's amazing. <laughs> Why are you upset? Oh, 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 oh. What'd you do? What'd you do? Um, okay, I want to hear what these different sound toys sound like. So let's play that. No, don't, don't cry. Oh. Hear that? It's like, it's like a rattle. Okay. So play with this one. Garrett, watch your daughter for crying out loud. Stop leaving the room. Oh gosh, I hope I don't have to deal with this on a basic. Oh. It's squeaky. And what about this one? What is this? The best buddy. Okay, so it's like another little toy. Hey, stop trying to do other things. You have a child. Get out of here, welcome wagon. I don't want to talk to you right now. How did I gain relationship with them? Uh. Those giggles are so cute. Garrett, get back here. Let's try some baby food. Let's try her first. So kids, here we got yogurt, applesauce, mashed mangoes, smashed avocado, papaya, mashed peas, crushed carrots, pumpkin pea, puri, I hope I pronounced it right, smashed lemon, ice cream, rice porridge, oatmeal cereal, sweet potato puree, and homemade hummus. I kind of want to try her for ice cream for the first time because, oh, that's going to be so cute. <laughs> And I might add a mobile to this, just because I want to see. So they have two mobiles. There's uh, the birds and then space. It doesn't matter which one you do. They all play music and help your baby go to sleep. Okay. Okay, Garrett. Let's see if they fix these high chairs. They said they did. Oh. Oh. Okay. Aww. That is so cute. <laughs> oh, that's here. I want to try something different in a second, but the big thing is, is that toddlers... Why are you sad? What's the matter? Rest time for being awake for too long. Oh, 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 no problem, Lauren. We'll put Lauren to bed. You have to comfort some of these toddlers because they might have a hard time going to sleep without help, so I'm really excited to see what happens. Let's take little Laura in the bed. She's tired. Oh, ah. So obviously we can customize her. I just, I just didn't do that. I'm not going to. I might review Cass in a second. Oh, look, he's comforting her, helping her go to sleep. Oh, oh gosh. Come. 
Oh, oh gosh. Soothe, soothe her, soothe her. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, she's fussy. Aw, there's a little kiss goodnight. Soothe her to sleep. Well, that's adorable. I, oh my gosh, I love that so much. Now, there obviously are a lot of traits I have not experienced yet. Right now, I want to see the customizability of Tyra. So we're just going to hit here and to change Sim, and we're going to see what I can do with the toddler. Dang. Not now, Garrett. Aww. So what do we got here? So we got some... We got some generics. See, like, they can have all the skin colors of the game. They can have different teeth. That's cool. Like, they can have no teeth. They can have this teeth or that teeth. They can't have any brow scars. Nothing there. They can have birthmarks. Now, these are supposed to fade away over time. But, you know, you can have for more gameplay situations. They have preset faces. Let's see about hair. Okay, we got a good amount of hair. Now, obviously, this is just feminine. So, I'm going to turn that off and we're going to see all of them. So these are the hairs that they can have. Okay. Hats. What can they wear? They can wear a baby helmet and they can wear whatever this thing is. <laughs> Wait, turn off feminine. Oh, I'm in sleep. I I need to not be in sleep if I want to see more. <laughs> okay, so we got all these hats. Oh, and they can wear the hat from Nifty Knitting. Good to know. Good to know. Any sunglasses? Okay, they can wear some kinds of glasses. No earrings, no necklaces, which, which makes sense. They're fully customizable, so... We can create every single outfit. It looks like they have a lot of clothes that were either transferred over from toddlers or were made specifically for this life state, which is cute. So that's good to know that there's that little detail. So something they mentioned about the infants is that they might grow up unhappy if you do not pay too much attention to them, which I do really like that idea. Can I mess with the toys? I can put them in my inventory and I can give them the toddler or infant. Okay, I'm just gonna speed up time. I might him do his own thing while Lauren sleeps. Okay, Lauren's starting to wake up. Now, There, I did not see any changing tables, so I believe that's specific to the new pack. So we'll just have to change her uh, some other way. Um, let's see, baby care. Pick up, check. Give Lauren an how do I how do I change her diaper? Uh wait, where's my sim going? Oh yeah, I forgot. They updated the autonomy so Sims automatically will respond to crying babies. Let Lauren know. I wait, did she just go to her she just Yeah, she went in her diaper. I don't have a bathtub. I kinda wanna see bath time. That's I'm getting rid of my shower. <laughs> I'm gonna get us a bath. There we go. Okay, Lauren. Let's give Lauren a bath. I want to see how cute that looks. Aww. Come on. Come on, Lauren. Let's go get you a bath. Then we'll try new food in a sec. My guy needs to go to the bathroom. Not now. Okay, they get like a little seat to sit in. Let's see what's going on. Aww, that's cute. <laughs> Look at the little ducky. <laughs> they sound adorable too. This is this is amazing. I love new life states. I always welcome them with open arms. This is by far the cutest one. <laughs> Aww. Okay, so he's done with her. So let's use the bathroom. Um, Lauren, you might need food soon. Oh, she's going to play with her toy. Oh, what does it say? Loved. Adorish. Adoration? Adoration? Adoration. I think that's how it's pronounced. Fills Lauren with contentment. So basically, she likes people being nice to her and being around her and like, oh, you're so cute. Like, stuff like that. Let's try a new food. Let's go with something that's the opposite of ice cream. So, does it. She's tried it, so I don't know why it's saying never tried. So we'll just have to try something else. Let's go with something that's completely different from yogurt. Let's go with sour lemon. I kind of want to see how the lemon reacts. Because, well, they put that iconic thing that you see on the internet with babies reacting to lemon for the first time where, like, their face squishes up. Looks like me. <laughs> Probably looked like me when I tried rhubarb by itself for the first time. I do love sour tasting things. All right. 
We're going to try lemon this time, Lauren. You ready for that, Lauren? You want to try lemon? Here's some lemon. Oh, look, the cups are different. That's a good little detail. Shows they really cared about this. What you think? Uh-oh. Lauren disliked Ma Smash Lemon. Oh, she pushed it away. Probably best to try something else next time. Oh, she even threw it on the floor. Oh, she sneezed. <laughs> Look, she literally says, she does not like lemon. Okay. Let's try pumpkin. Do you like pumpkin? And also, why did you trash my house? Oh, whatever. She's cute. Okay, what did you think about that? She loved pumpkin. Okay, so she likes pumpkin. Well, she loves the pumpkin, that's for sure. <laughs> Aww. So yeah, I do like how they have it so the baby could be like, Oh, I don't like this, or oh, I like that. Weirdly enough, they said back when they did the live stream that this didn't feed the infants as much, but it does. It does feed them, like, perfectly fine. Oh, she needs to go back to bed again. But I want to get a mobile. Okay, first, let her out. I'm sorry. Oh, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. Shh, I'll get you taken care of. Don't, don't worry, we'll let you out. I'll let you out so you can play with your toys. Go play. Oh, she, oh, she can play in the cabinet. It's just like, oh. Now, obviously, changes will come with the uh, new pack coming out, so we'll just have to see what happens then. But right now, we'll just play with base game. I love the infant so much. Uh, they're so cute. Okay, I'm gonna get a mobile. And this might be the last thing we do, just because I want to see what it's like. Man, it takes a long time to upgrade. Oh, she's sad. Why are you upset? Needs help. Lauren feels a bit abandoned. Maybe making a fuss will help. And then, so sleepy. Lauren is getting sleepy. Even the calmest infants start to show emotion when they need rest. Become so, so sleepy. Oh, that's cute. They had, like, a different thing there. Okay, Garrett. Put Lauren there. So there's, so there's the uh, mobile. There's two versions of it. What kind of lullabies can we play? We can play quite a few. And it's like real songs. So I'm just gonna already not tell you about, not not have you listen to them because copyright. So yeah, I would have to say I love this new update. It's so adorable and just oh my gosh. I love it so much, and I can't wait to play with more of it. So yeah, I I have to say, I love this new update. This is just amazing that we got a new life state, especially with it being infant. I love this so much. So thank you guys for watching. Watch some of my other content, uh, and keep an eye out. Once the pack gets released soon this week, I will officially get it, and we will do like a very short episodic let's play of it, just to have fun and introduce ourselves to the new pack. But thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys again soon. Bye!